All right, so got the day off. Thought I'd get up early anyway and get a nice sunrise time lapse, but then this happened. So I've been out on the water when it's like this, usually not on purpose. You know, we, uh, we start off and maybe it's a little foggy and then all of a sudden, boom, it's totally socked in. And uh, it can be kind of scary out there. That is one reason why I do like having the GPS unit because uh, even if you have been on the water in a particular area a thousand times when you can't see anything, you can't see anything. But sometimes it's nice to not know exactly where you are. So I love stopping underneath these bridges and I've actually never stopped underneath this one before. And this is looking like a pretty awesome little spot. May have to actually bring a rod with me next time I stop here. All right, so, I mean, I can see bass swimming all over the place and it's crazy that I've driven over this bridge. I don't know how many times never pulled off the road and stopped. I just always drove by and thought, huh, wonder what's going on down there. <laughs> so, like I said, sometimes it's good to sort of get off the beaten path and maybe check out something that you didn't check out before, try new things, and I guarantee you next time I pull down here, I'm gonna have a rod ready to go. So I've driven by this park so many times, but I've never stopped and looked around. And this is a pretty awesome park. These are a bunch of amazing pecan trees, uh, the rivers right here. I mean, I just can't believe I never stopped here before. So I've stopped underneath this bridge a bunch of times, but I still remember when I didn't know what was down this particular road. I didn't know this bridge was here. Uh, I knew it crossed the river at some point, but I just didn't really know a lot about this whole area. And that's kind of cool because now it's, uh, it's just a regular stop and you know, I don't have to use my GPS. I know how far it's gonna take me to get to the next town and you know, where I can get gas and all that kind of stuff. But I still remember that feeling that I had the first time I pulled down underneath here. And that makes me think 
I need to find another route <laughs> to get from point A to point B just to kind of keep it fresh. They say it's good for your brain to make these new connections, to discover new things, and I think that's one of the things I like about what I do for a job, and that is taking people fishing because it's always changing. The conditions are changing, the water's changing, the weather's changing, my clients are changing, <laughs> and the fish are always changing. So, yeah, I guess it's just sort of... Uh, one of the cool things about life is you can always change it up. You can always learn something new. You can always take the scenic route.